I'm Dr. James Kennedy's Texas Foot and Ankle Centers. I have a lot of patients that come into my office and they complain of burning pain, tingling pain, uh, lack of sensation of their feet. A lot of people say that it feels like stones, uh, that they're walking on stones, or it feels like they uh, have cactus needles in their feet. Uh, lots of people say that their uh, feet feel like they're on fire. Um, that could be a sign of peripheral neuropathy. Now, there's many causes of peripheral neuropathy. By far, the most common is diabetic neuropathy. The next common, most common is what we call idiopathic neuropathy, and that means that we really don't understand what's going on with the neuropathy. You have uh, different types of neuropathy from AIDS patients to trauma to sciatic nerve pain to vitamin deficiencies to uh, chemical reactions from medications. But I do a nerve biopsy. I do a nerve biopsy through uh, BACO, B-A-K-O. Uh, they're a pathology group out of Georgia. And I do uh, nerve biopsy testing, nerve fiber density testing. And what we're doing, we're checking the quality of the nerves and the quantity of the nerves. So the quality of the nerves, they actually check the size of the nerves, compare it to normal looking nerves, and actually make a comparison. They also do the number of nerves or the quantity of nerves. What they do is they actually go in and count the nerves, determine if it's within normal range. Now I have uh, I've seen lots of patients through the years, and I've been able to, able, I've been able to help a lot of patients uh, throughout the years. There's some that I cannot help, but with this biopsy, lots of times I can tell whether a patient truly has neuropathy. In my opinion, this is really the only way to determine if a patient is truly having neuropathy. So right now, we're going to do a small little biopsy. People can actually watch it to see uh, what I'm actually doing. It's a very simple video, but I hope a lot of patients will learn a little bit from this, but they'll find out um, nerve fiber density testing is really not that big of a deal. Great. Take that, leads a little bit, like that, and then you take a little pair of sterile scissors, a little forcep, go in there, just like this, barely lift it up on the side. scissors. That's all there is to it. And then what I do, I put this inside. The fixative. There we go. Stick it inside there just like that. can't see it but it's in there. And then put this on there. See how small that is right there. I'll stick that on there and she'll wear this today and then she can take that off. And literally she will have a scar about the size of that little lesion right there. It's not bad at all. But that's how a uh, that's how a nerve biopsy is performed. And in about two weeks, I'll get a results and then uh, we'll just go from there. But uh, um, I'm very excited to do these. I've been doing these for about three or four years and I've helped a lot of people with this. Thanks for watching.